Booster shots do a very good job of preventing severe cases of COVID. Dr. Eric Topol is director of the Scripps Research Translational Institute. He told KPBS keeping up with the latest boosters reduces the chance of elderly people being hospitalized by 80 percent. But booster shots don't do much to prevent infections. He says, yes, masking does help with that. They're not perfect by any means, and there's reluctance to use them. And, uh, and tr- particularly, it's hard to use them. If you're a holiday gathering and you're having a, a meal or a party, I mean, you know, it's hard to wear a mask throughout all that, of course. So we need something more than masks. And there's only one other thing we can do. He says nasal vaccines are, pardon the pun, our best shot to block infections. Those spray vaccines are effective in the very place where virus-laden aerosols enter the body. They're already being used in India and China. I'm confident we will have nasal vaccines that work. The only question is, do they work for a few months or is it longer? Uh, They should work against all of the variants. Um, And... You know, this is something that would be very exciting in the ability to start to block infections and the the whole tr- chain of transmission. Topol says he hopes to see some news from health officials about nasal spray availability in the weeks ahead. Meanwhile, he says San Diego is going through its worst flu season in many years. The good news, this year's flu vaccine, which targets four different strains, is providing some good protection. People just need to get the shot. Thomas Fudge, KPBS News.